My name is Sam Kroll, and I'm Professor of Education at California State University at San Bernardino. And uh, while there, I've developed um, a program in holistic and integrative education. And uh, I've been working with the Earth Charter with that program for many years now. And uh, it's one of my passions and one of my real commitments. My interest in the Earth Charter is that it, it provides um, a really broad understanding of how to approach sustainability, of how to uh, integrate uh, ideas and values into uh, our lives, our organizations, uh, our practices, and our, our communities. One of the things that, uh, that I feel is important in when we approach education for sustainable development and when we start to understand uh, the values and assumptions that are embedded in the Earth Charter is to not only learn how to think differently about these topics and ideas, but also how to perceive the world around us in a different kind of way. You know, we live in a world that's uh, increasingly uh, connected and interrelated. And um, uh, the assumptions that guide us in that kind of world uh, are new assumptions, they're new values, they're new understandings that can lead to an enormous changes. And in our world we have issues throughout the globe, throughout our own country in the United States uh, that, that really need to be addressed. The course I've been asked to teach is Education and Values for Sustainable Development with the Earth Charter. And, uh, and in that course um, it's uh, the subtitle I've chosen is Teaching What Really Matters. Uh, so when we're talking about teaching for sustainability and when we're talking about using the Earth Charter as an integral part of our teaching and what we do and, uh, uh, and the environments we create, then the question is, how do I do it? And I, I, I have some ideas around this and some practices that have worked for quite a few teachers. And uh, I'm really looking forward to sharing some of this, this understanding. Uh, the course will be designed around understanding the principles of the Earth Charter in a much more deep and fundamental way, uh, much more about the fundamental assumptions around sustainability and how those can be used to, to incorporate practical changes in a classroom setting or in a school environment. Uh, we'll also have opportunities to talk with other educators as well as Costa Rican educators uh, about what they are doing and to exchange ideas, to create networks and, and um, partnerships with one another. And, uh, and finally, we'll also be, uh, be exploring creative possibilities and uh, working on projects together that we can take back into our local communities. In this course, I hope to uh, generate this conversation about how do we carry forward and discuss and integrate uh, the values and the understandings of sustainability and the Earth Charter into our schools and into our classrooms. And when we start to have a conversation about what that means, and we start to center that conversation around the things that make sense for sustaining this earth and for living together in peace and for having just relationships with, uh, with those in our communities and those who are marginalized in our world. We start to, to get a real sense of, of, of what it means to be a human. It isn't that we have to add something new to the curriculum. It isn't that we have to go to school to learn a whole new vocabulary. The idea is to bring about a, an environment and to create an environment that sustains itself and that teaches itself in the way we honor and respect one another, in the way we participate in, in alleviating the issues uh, of ecology and social justice and, uh, and um, democratic participation in the very environments in which we live. There are ways to involve uh, kids and students in that process to have them as the creators of this environment with us. So, uh, so these are the things that I, I hope will come out of the course and uh, where we become uh, participants in, if you will, a, a curriculum, a place where our localities become our classroom as well, where uh, students become uh, teachers among themselves and, uh, and with us. For me, the important thing is to ask how do we facilitate 
bringing about a culture of sustainability and a culture of the Earth Charter uh, in a way that actually um, allows the culture to be the teacher rather than us. Costa Rica is an amazing country. It, in many ways, is a model of many of the, the, um, the principles that are envisioned by the Earth Charter. It's an incredible place to take this kind of course and to um, create this kind of conversation together. And as educators, we're about making a difference. And if we're teach what we're teaching and how we're teaching is not making a difference, then, uh, then we make that long drive home every day and we start questioning ourselves. But when we make a difference, when we are, when we, when we are moving toward a vision of, of helping students um, kind of realize their own creativity and, um, and find meaning in what they're learning, um, then everything works. It's, uh, that's the joy of being a teacher.